Let's try and get this thing out of the way. Out of the way. Bentornati. Welcome back to Star Sector, guys. We just finished uh, dealing with a couple of bounties around here. It was a pather, a starbase station. Why can't I say station? Pather station and then a normal pirate station. And now we're gonna make a very quick stop at Nachiketa here. What's the closest one? Yama. It's this one, probably. Yeah, let's stop at Nachiketa real quickly. Turn the transponder on and then jump. Let's buy some fuel. And then uh, we are gonna take a look at what else can we do around here. We need a ton of money. Also, I think we can start spending some of our money. I mean... All right, let's see what we have in here. These guys, I think, we could sell. I think I think we have a number of these already. Also this. Probably also this and this. Probably not heavy machine guns, not so many. This, this, this. I'm thinking also this. Vulcans, not so many, so I'm gonna keep the Vulcans. Typhoon Reaper launcher, I'm gonna keep for now. These guys, I probably have tons. Hammer class torpedoes. Long range PD lasers. These are really common. Uh, salamanders are common. Light auto cannons, light machine guns. Yeah, all this stuff. All this stuff we can sell. Three broadswords we can sell. One talon we can sell. Expanded missile rack that we already know. We can sell. Oh, 100 of this probably. I can sell. Take all of that from me. That's probably not a good price. Actually, let me... Let me see if there's... A better price close by. Oh, Yama. No, that's the best place to buy. Uh, oh, Chico stock. Yeah, I can sell a Chico stock. But from you, I want beautiful fuel at 27. 27 is not the best price ever, is it? So in the end, I pay 35. What's my range now? My range is good, is not super great. Especially because I want to do some more hunting. So, give me more. Oh, now unit price is... <clears throat> now unit price is... Uh, 33... Let's get another thousand. Okay. I feel good about that. Open the com directory. Oh my god! Our lost... <laughs> Grant, my lost twin! Freelance administrator! What have you been doing all this time? Heard you might be getting into the colony business! What can you do? He has no special talents? Oh, by the way, I can't hire more administrators at the moment. <laughs> Let's look at the dockside bar. There's nobody in the dockside bar. Let's go to command center. Oh, yeah, you probably didn't see this. I've put... Uh, Eris Serian, freelance administrator that has uh, fleet logistics at 3 uh, to manage hell. But 
I think we can have better. Now, how can I see where my administrators... Oh, uh, manage administrators. I can only have one. So I guess if I find a better one... Because administrators can have up to two skills, right? So if I find an, uh, an administrator that has two skills, I might fire Ares and hire another one. I might even consider spending a point um, to level up so that I can have more administrators. But for now, plot a route to Aslan because we're going to get to Chikamostok real quick. Yes. I'm seeing intel coming through. What is this? Okay, we have a number of bounties up in here. Big no. Big no. It's a resounding nope. This one, I mean. This guy's... I could think about it. It's really close to home. So, another trip could be up here, then here. No, oh, five days remaining. No. Not a thing. Do I want to go this way? Sixty-one days remaining for this guy. I think we have to wait for more bounties to show up. Where's Chigamasok? In here. Or maybe we can try and see if there's um, missions available. Trade goods. Chigomostok, you give me a better price for this. Well, 14 is better than 6. Then you're gonna give me... You're gonna sell me... ...500 units of supplies. Yes. Confirm. Then we're gonna visit the Dockside Bar. No, Pather, no. Concerned woman, what are you concerned about? You want me to bring domestic goods... Home? At hell. You're gonna pay me to bring domestic goods to hell. Why? Absolutely yes. Thank you. 85,000. I mean, it's it's not it's not a huge amount of money, but accept the delivery contract. We we're, we're going to go there anyway. That was just the best contract ever. Um, okay. The first time I clicked on this, it was because I want to go in here and spend the money, right? That That's what I wanted to do. Can I, can, can I have another industry in here? Probably not yet. I'm mining. Yeah, and we, and we said that we only want to do the mining in here. We have the waste station. We probably can have the patrol HQ though. Yes, and that's gonna be 300k to spend. Yes, patrol HQ is gonna increase the size of fleets uh, in the entire system, I think. Do I wanna top up on growth incentives? Yes, do that. Then, back in here. Hey, Moss. Hey, Moss. Size 4. I think you are... No, I can't have industry, can I? 
or not. Do I want to do fuel production or heavy industry first? Hmm. There's also tech mining in here. I think we should have another planet. Another habitable planet. Because... It's gonna be a long time before I can do three different industries in here, you know? And tech, I, I definitely want to do tech mining. Okay, but I, I cannot build another industry at the moment. I have the patrol HQ, I have the station. Do I want to turn this into a military base? Oh, it's an industry. The military base is an industry. I see. Could make heavy batteries. Don't know that I need that necessarily. The mega port is gonna increase accessibility and stability by a lot. And I think it kind of makes sense to have a mega port in Bespin. And it's also gonna reduce, I mean, accessibility reduces upkeep. I, th I, th I think I remember something like that. Yeah. Yeah, I want the Megaport at Bespin. Upgrade. Do it. Growth incentives. Top up. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what I want to do. Then... Corwin. The problem with Corwin is that anything I build in here um, produces one less because of the parasites that the spores that make everybody happy but kind of kind of slow. <laughs> At the same time though, this place grows quickly. This is size 7 and it's gonna be size 8 at some point. So, even if it's one less, it's still gonna be a lot because of the size of the colony. Right? Am I right? So in here, I could have a, an, an industry. So I could actually have... No, tech mining cannot happen in here because it requires ruins. Let me see. I could have the heavy industry in here. So, question, guys. Huge brain question. What do I put on Corwin? The fuel production or the heavy industry? Um, role playing wise, I like more the idea of having fuel production on Bespin. Just because that's a gas giant. Um, but if there's a good reason, to do it the other way. I mean, this thing is gonna produce a lot of stuff, look at that. Supplies, heavy armaments, ship hulls. Okay, we, we need more money though. We absolutely need more money. So, I've got fuel, i got supplies, and I've got this stuff to bring home, but I need an objective. Can I get there in time? Is the question. Not in time for this. No, I don't I don't have enough. I don't have enough to take this. But I could take this if I can get there in time. It's 29 days at base burn level, however, the road is... Eh, I can probably do this. But if I do this, then I, then I go home, right? 
No, 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 no. Let's 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 look at this better. 147 days. There's pirates. There's uh <laughs> they they are making a system bounty uh against pirates in Tritakin. There's this guy and this thing. But it's so far. It's super far. Okay, the the bet the bet in here, the gambit, is that I'm gonna go up here, deal with this, and something else will show up in the meantime. And if we don't find anything else, we can just go to it. I mean, Jurash Star System, Hell Planet. We, we don't like go to hell in that sense, but we kind of go to hell and we um, we deliver uh, those, uh, not supplies, those are consumer goods and get those extra 80,000 credits. So, Pirate Base, Ludwig Church Base in where? Delta Cash. Let's go Delta Cash. Oh, monthly income. That's good. That's that that's also a good way to make money. Getting paid. Procurement. Chico Mostok <laughs> wants five almost six thousand units. Like how do you successfully trade fuel in this game, guys? Seriously. It it, it doesn't work. You will need to have so many tankers. I just don't think it's viable. Also, there's not a lot of places that can sell you uh, 6,000 units of fuel. Okay, I think I have to work my way around this cloud now. Maybe not. Yeah. I can go through this. That was just l being lucky. Uh, Delta Cash. I don't know exactly where. I have to go, but let's get in and take a look. First of all, is the is the bounty still active? 31 days remaining. I need to scan. Okay, there's a fleet in here, but I don't think there's gonna be a station in here. Let's go towards Delta Cash 3. Not in here. Then we are left with the inner ring and then this and this. I don't think a station will be so close to the sun. However, there's a there's a ping in there. Probably something to explore. Come on, pirate station, where is you? 24 days remaining. Oh, did I take a look at this planet? I didn't. If Murphy's Laws tell us anything, it's gonna be the last planet we look at. 
it's, it's not this one. It's this one then. Dang it. Just going around like a fool. Oh, uh, the war ended, I think. It was close to the sun. <laughs> what are you doing in there, you fools? Cooking to death, probably. We can trade goods with them. 23... It's, it's not a fantastic price. Unless I do this. <laughs> nah. I have tons of already. You have something interesting? Not really. Consider your military options. Engage the orbital station. Continue to battle. So, what did we do last time? I think something like this. Hundred and forty. It's already a lot. Can I do it without bombers? Hundred and sixty four. This is not super big. Let's try like this. 153. This might be a little bit risky, but not too much. I just need to remember not to stay uh, too close to the station. Let the damage spread a little bit also to my other ships. Bombs incoming. Right. Those lasers are fantastic. of kinetics. A lot of kinetic damage coming this way. Let's do this a little bit. Hi buddy. How's it going? Oh yeah, oh yeah. It's done. This was a medium-sized station anyway. I probably went in a little bit overpowered already. Let's get, let's try and get this thing out of the way. Out of the way. Torpedoes out. Nice. Claim victory. That was easy. No, thank you. Pick through the wreckage. 
157, yes. I think, I think, I think I'm finally finding the balance. Salvage, give me a little bit of that. Am I in the sun's corona? No, I don't I don't think so, right? I I I think it says somewhere around there when you actually are in the sun's corona. So that was a little bit more money. It was. That's a lot of legions. So I don't see anything else that I'm willing to engage right now. So I tell you what, let's go to hell. Oh, wait a second, there was something to explore around here. Let's not go to hell right away. What is this? Are you a research station? A minor equipment cache. Minor equipment cache. Do I even want to look at a minor equipment cache? It's not even a technology cache. It's equipment, so it's gonna be small weapons. Nah. I don't want. I don't want to look at that. The other thing is there was probably a fleet stationed around here. But it's probably nothing big. Nah, 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 nah. I don't want to waste more time in here. Let's bring the goods home. Again, at war with the Tritakian. Come on. You were just getting to know each other, guys. I think... I think... Zero Thompson is really... You know, starting to be... Really fed, you know, with this aggressive politics, you know? Uh, where was hell? System map. Hell is in here, close to Ivavik. Ibavik. Ivavik. Ivavik, how are you? There we are. Hello. Your fleet approaches Hell. Your fleet goes into orbit around Hell. <laughs> you contact the relevant parties and drop off the cargo at the agreed upon dockside locations. Yes, 85,000. Continue. Manage the colony. How are you guys doing? Do you want metals? Do you use metals for anything? You don't. You don't use metals for anything. Growth incentives. Yeah. You are about to get to level 4. Which is cool. The patrol HQ is nearly done. Which is also cool. And what else can I do in here? There's a com directory. Oh, there's nobody available. In hell. Strange. Out of all the places, hell, it would seem like a place where you find people available. But, you know. Let's go visit Hamos. Man, this system is big. Dockside bar? Nobody. Com directory? Nobody there. You export metals. This is gonna have absolutely no effect. 
but maybe you are gonna sell those and that's gonna be good? I don't know. Maybe. Uh, industries 2 out of 2. I still can't do anything in here. Growth incentives. Yes. Let's do that. So I have enough money so that I can do something at Hamos. No, I can't. No, not Hamos. What am I talking about? Corwin. I wanted to say Corwin. Yes, I can. I can build an industry in Corwin. What should that be, guys? Let me know what you think. And at the same time, I think it is time to settle another planet in here. Especially another planet that has ruins, and there is a planet with ruins in here. I think, and I think it's right here. It's Ibos. Show planet info. Yes, Ibos has scattered ruins. And maybe at some point we can also do a little bit of mining. 175, it's not even that bad when it comes to habitability. Dust world, 200%. 175. 225. 175. So we, we don't have really habitable planets in here. Apart from Amos, of course. Wait. This is 150. Strange. So at some point we want to do this for the scattered ruins. And also, if we want to, you know, inject a little bit more life into our fuel economy, this has plus two volatiles. Cool. Cool beans. What about other planets in the SAR system? What about other stars in the vicinity? I, di I didn't really... Acid world... Baron... I didn't really explore too much, did I? Oh, look at that! Oh yeah, this was good. Rich farmland. There's a little bit of everything. And there's the old space elevator. Huh. This might be another place. Yeah, the wonder planet. I remember this. This one this this is one of the very first planets that we surveyed. Yeah, at some point I might really consider settling in the Wonder System. And what about this place? 300% not nice. No, thank you. And I might take a look at this, at this planet, but I don't have much faith. It's gonna be great. Uh, and, I, and I've never been in Kaddish. Never been in there. Alright, guys. You know what? There's potentially a lot that can be done in here. But let me know what you think. What should be the next move? Also, if you would prefer me to stop playing this and start playing in the new version. Alright, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And I hope to see you again in the next episode. Alla prossima!